Bing, bang. How you doing? <laughs> How you doing? I'm doing just fine. I'd like for you guys to take a second and enjoy my poem that I'm going to read. <clears throat> it's called Slob on My Knob. Slob on my knob. Like corn on a cob. Check in with me. And do your job. I said slob on my knob. Like corn on a cob. Check in with me. Bitch, do your job. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. That was hot. I was listening to the group called Three Six Mafia. That was really hot. And thought I would go ahead and put my input on that. That's where that generated from. Those guys have some really, really good poems and stuff. You know, a lot of people should listen to them. You know what I'm saying? They have a lot of You know, know I ate corn for dinner. Yeah, I was slobbing on some corn you, on the cob. You was doing it now? I was on the corn on the I was cob actually thinking it. about, you know, getting me some corn on a cob. Mm -hmm. But after I said I couldn't really do the job, I just opened a can and just, you know, got the, the pellets and stuff. My corner cup was this big. Yeah, what it was? Yeah, it was no, this big. You know, they're pretty, they're pretty damn good this season yeah, around. It's, you know. it's, it's definitely season for them. It's too. a season for it. It is. It is. It is. Sweet they and everything. They have some yellow ones. Cup. They have some some white ones and stuff. You know, some and sweet ones. right up on it. They have it for like uh, five for two dollars at um, Farmer's Market and shit. Shit, they have Walmart too. Yeah, it's pretty fucking good. I yeah. like to get mine. Yeah. Like, you know, the real Farmer's Market out the street. Damn. Let's me know. But the person has really put some love into it so I can slob on that knob. <laughs> like know? corn on a cob. And check it with me. Bitch, do your job. Do the job. Do the job. Do your job, <laughs> bitch. So <laughs> nice, man. <laughs> I'm going to repeat that at the, you know, at the children's place tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> at the children's place. I have to do a, you know, a walk them in at the children's place. I think they will like that poem, you know? I think they would, too. They're going to teach them a few things. Yeah, teach them a couple things, you know what I'm saying? Teach them motherfuckers. Corn, corn is good for your body. Yeah, if they exactly actually corn. started doing That's these it. poems this way from these people to let them know that these are the ingredients that you need in your body to live, <laughs> these kids would love to eat this shit. Well, corn definitely tastes good, so. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Oh, let me fix my mic. I'm going to oh. do my job tonight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, talking to the mic. How you doing? Is it is it is it close to your mouth? Is it good enough? Yeah, it's close. It's close. I, can, I know it ain't the golden dick. It's not the golden. It's not the golden dick. I mean, you know, I guess we had to go back to black. Remember where our roots came from? <laughs> <laughs> you know, the roots. <laughs> I was gonna say it's the black history month. Well, we got that, didn't yeah, we? we? Got yeah, we got past that. Yeah, we got past that. We got past black history. Month. You know, I ain't seen the black one in a long time. So we were go. just on it last week. I know. Well, we were, but we you know, were, we I were. thought that you know last week they would have probably like disappeared. You know, <laughs> <laughs> I guess they say once you go oh, black, yeah, you, you can never go back. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah! Once you, you go black, you, you can never go back. Day, huh? Yeah, I wanted to go back to the golden days. You know, it makes me feel more you know richer. What I do, <laughs> you know, speaking into it makes me feel like I'm speaking, you know, some real shit. You know, now I'm just you know, you go black, you never can go back. <laughs> hey, you heard they say. Two days is over. Two <laughs> days is over. I guess we had to get our mouth back together. Cause that one was pretty wide. Yeah, yeah, that was. <laughs> that, that was. I couldn't eat on my mouth for that. But you know, I don't like sucking dick anyway. So, oh, I mean, yeah. you know, <laughs> I do it for the coin. Well, <laughs> Everything I do you on here is for the coin. <laughs> I don't even think I open my mouth for this right now. <laughs> I ate a pussy for the coin. <laughs> I sucked on his dick for the coin. <laughs> I slept with your dad for the coin. <laughs> I'm just saying. I mean, just in case you know, motherfucker ever no, catch me someplace, watch. they just know it's for the coin. It's well, the I want to watch if you sucking the dick and eating some coochie. And I'm just saying it would be for the coin. That's all I'm saying. I'm just saying if you do, I don't want you to think that you know it's out of pleasure. It's for the coin. That's all. It's all for the coin. That's it. That's all it's for. I like to get my coin and go about my business. Go ahead. I don't like my jaws locking. So let me go ahead that shit. No, my child's almost locked on me the other day. Ooh. It did. It really did. I was like kind of feeling it in my shit. I was like, God, damn. Fuck you, just don't forget your I had a fuck like, because my bitch like, like had me eat up pussy like three times back to back. Like, she wanted like, you know, get the she triple, want, yeah, see, the triple I, dose I like and shit. That. And I was like, all right, you know. Well, not like back to back. I like to keep you sucking it. I like my <laughs> pussy suck like, I, like a nigga like his dick suck. I, I was like trying to get up and she's like, no, get back down here. And I was like, all right. All right, and then you know I was getting up the second time. She's like, "What are you doing?" I'm like, yeah. "Bitch, you just bust twice. Like, what are you, what are you going, what are you going to give me in return? Like, what are you? Because oh, I don't want to go three times. Like, I just want to get my nose and go sleep. Like, no, I, I, 
Like, come on. She's like, come on, this one more time. Like this. Right. neck wasn't right. hurting. No, nah, my neck not. Bitch, I got a long ass neck. <laughs> you got to hurt the sections before I, I start really feeling that, that shit. shit. I ain't got time for that shit. That shit gonna be hurting my neck. I don't really have to move my neck. This is all in the mouth. Like, it's all in the mouth. Yeah, but you, I mean, it's all in the mouth. Don't you really know. don't have to move your neck at all. Well, you know, maybe you I ain't so long. I'm thinking about sucking dick. He got to do a lot of that. Yeah, see, that's sucking dick. You ain't got to do a whole lot of this. pussy. I mean, see all this. And even if all I do move my motion. head, you know, you always you ain't got to go oh, too bitch, far. No, you just got to be no. like right here, like. Uh, you ain't got to. You got a short neck. That shit. I ain't got the no, long neck at all. It's too much. It's too much. My neck hurt. Just about thinking about it. Oh, my jaw's just locked. Mm-mm. Oh man, I hate to be your man. You suck my dick. No, I suck my man dick though. I, don't, I bet you did. I mean, it ain't make my neck and my teeth hurt and jaws hurt and all that other shit. But I'm a sucker because I told you ain't another bitch ain't gonna suck his shit. I understand that. I mean, hey, get that trophy for the coin. <laughs> Hello. Oh, I got to do it for the coin. Oh, got that, honey. That's what I'm saying. You got to keep it intact for the coin. You know what I'm saying? It hurts yeah. because of the coin. Yeah. You got to get that coin. Yeah. <laughs> you can be that bitch dying. I'm dying for the coin. Hello. Hey, <laughs> get that thing popping. Shit. You got to do what you got to do for the coin. <laughs> sure, dude. Sure Anybody dude. ever ask you, it's for the coin. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you, it's for the coin. Yeah, but y'all right, I'm with y'all right now. I mean, you loud over there. I'm gonna go ahead and get this little goddamn little intro started. If you don't mind, get it started for the coin. All right, for this coin. Mm -hmm. Welcome to I want let uh, I want Luscious TV. What the <laughs> fuck? I don't know my own name. <laughs> never get it right. <laughs> never get it right, Jesus. Well, won't you help me then? I, I I've never really what you called it. I know. <laughs> I mean, I could probably remember it in my head a little bit if you start talking. <laughs> But I've never really like you know me like hey that's me it's my goal. It's my oh, you start this shit over there. Okay. Welcome to I Want Luscious TV where you, you be, be sure, sure to, to learn, learn the real his and her sexual side. So get your pens and papers ready. ready to take notes because us girls, us girls is going to light you up with tips and tricks, tricks that you don't want to miss. And here on this show, of course, we, we talk only about talk about sex, sex, and more sex. That's it. That's it. Dicks, pussies, assholes, titties. You know, like they got the little things where they got the little uh what you call it, you can go ahead and put your dick inside with the titty thing. I saw the um a real sex the other night. I'm not I'm gonna bring it up later. But it's like it's really it's really amazing. For like bitches who got real small titties and they can't like do the titty fucking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> so, so they could feel the titties like oh, you no, know. No, say how you get that. I mean, how you do it? I mean like they had this little thing, right? They had like these little cuppy things and it goes across the titties and shit, right? So just to feel the titties, just to feel the titties on the dick, and the other side holds it so push close. It? No, it holds. Actually, it just it goes across the titties. It don't push this this way. They have one they had that way, but I mean they still have it. But it's like for bigger titties, like for small titties, but but more bigger than like the oh, A cups and I don't shit. Wear those issues you know what I'm saying? So like I could never like put a dick in between my titties. Like never. I <laughs> that would be pointless for me. I'm <laughs> dick just lay right here. This is how the dick look in between my titties. <laughs> Nah, it's just like this. <laughs> just all around my titties. Just... Oh, look at my name. There's no way. See, you got cups and shit. My shit is just sitting. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> right here. This is how dick looks in between my titties. <laughs> She's not going. Like that. That's it. This is all bone right there. That's going to hurt the dick. That's going to hurt the dick. That's why I'm in the pussy. I ain't got to worry about all that. <laughs> Titty probably baby, for what? <laughs> for what? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what are we doing that for, babe? <laughs> what are you doing? What's up, well? <laughs> I can put my dimple in the coochie hole, but you know what I'm saying? Like, what are we doing that for? Like, what are we doing that for? <laughs> but <laughs> I never had those problems. So, teeth and dicks and stuff is not even my equation. But you go way back to saying what you were saying. Oh, so, you can <laughs> get this thing in for the coin. All right. Come on, back to the coins. <laughs> for all the new viewers and all the people who don't even know who us are. Is because that's Eads. what she was gonna say. <laughs> let's keep it real, bitch, because we are black. Is <laughs> I was trying to be on some old different shit. Shut up. Don't try to change it. We still gonna get the coin. <laughs> don't change a good thing. Don't you change a good thing. If it's good, don't you change it. All right. Well, is don't do it. About don't that. Do it. Is is <laughs> is that about it? Now, ghetto. That's how she want. That's how she want me to be, <laughs> girl. Because let them know. Yeah. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Because they walked up in here. Eh. They walked up into us. Eh. We didn't walk into them. Eh. Okay? Eh. Shoot. Shit. Well, I am. We ain't laying on Plymouth Rock. <laughs> I am X Triple X Adult Star <laughs> slash Exotic Rapper Luscious Kisses. And I'm the current porn star, Lust, the porn star, fucking Jones. Okay? okay. Welcome all the new viewers. And this is the I Want Luscious TV show. <laughs> Hey. <laughs> hey, we crazy. We, yeah, we crazy, but we work. We we keep it real. 
I'm gonna go back to the barbershop, girl. I just came from the barbershop three days ago. You couldn't even tell it, bitch. I don't know what's going on with this girl, fish girl. I bought this wig the other day, and I just put it on tonight. Girl, I don't know what's going on. Like, what's going on? Like, it's not that bad, though. Girl, it, it, it is to me, you know? Like, for real. I don't know Trump. what the fuck I'm going to do as far as this hair thing. I really don't. You know what I'm saying? It's cute. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Um, I mean, I think I'm at to start fucking my barber or something. Because, like, it shouldn't have to grow back in, like, two and three days. Okay, so this is what you did. So you go fuck your barber and let him arch my eyebrows for free. So what you saying is that you just trying to get on on the deal that I'm that I'm going to throw the pussy out of there. But he a fan of yours, so why you can't throw the pussy out for you? Go for us. Yes. Yes, he's a fan of yours. So can you go throw the pussy on this nigga so we can get some free shit? I don't want to. I can get my lap dance in a barbershop. Oh, God. If I go get this nigga my motherfucking pussy, I ain't going to be able to get his ass to fault me. Yes, you are. No, I won't. I got you on that. I got you on that. Michael, Bay, I'm telling you, every time I give a nigga oh, this motherfucking man. coochie, I can't get them up off me. You can't get a nigga to look out for that fellow man no more. You can't get a nigga to look out for that fellow man no more. You hear me? I can't. No, no, no. you can't get it done no more. You feel no. what I'm saying? I can't. I can't. I can't get. <laughs> I'm just trying to give you some free haircuts. She needs some eyebrow arches. I know the boy gonna yeah. need some free haircuts. I know the the the, 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 the whoever I was need some free haircuts. You know what yeah. I'm saying? You know, like the neighborhood niggas probably need some haircuts. Like. The man needs some hair, hair cuts, some of that. Like you know what I'm saying? Neighborhood I mean, you like to look out for the kitties, don't you? Don't you love the kids? Mine. Don't let's just love the kids. Mine. Sometimes. Not when you get on my damn nerves, but only mine. We need to move on to the sex. You just want me to get this nigga some pussy so I can get out of here by some free haircuts and shit. What the fuck do I get? Yeah, eyebrows. Dick, talks, like you said. Some eyebrows. Yeah. And freeness. A five minute fuck. And some money saved in your pocket for the haircuts. He's a good goddamn barber. I just want my eyebrows also. You go fuck him and you get my eyebrows arched. I ain't ready to do that. Let alone, I'm going to just stay to, for the fuck so I can get my eyebrows arched. That I only want to arch. I haven't arched in damn near almost two days. I don't want, I want my smiles to need to be arched. Are you ready to go with this topic? So you don't want to get my give eyebrows me no arched. You're making like a bitch. You ain't giving me the pussy, so I need to like look out for bitch. you on that. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying. I could get you the pussy, but you don't know. Could is the key word in that could. Shoulda, coulda, woulda, but you didn't. Get, no. Shoulda cut up with her, but if you I didn't. Give, if I give this bitch some pussy, this bitch can be back in my house a whole fucking goddamn month or two months. No, I won't because I have my own house and I don't want to be shaking up with you and your man and your kids. <laughs> so you guys have just come to mind. <laughs> 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 I'm going to be walking around the house. Hey, hey, who the fuck ate my motherfucking jelly sandwich up the refrigerator? Keanu, of these motherfucking kids. Look, this is shit I'm talking about. Like, I don't want to have to go through all that shit. My son eats in there and everybody shit. Don't I had fuck to dig down somebody's kid's throat and shit to get my shit back. I ain't with none of that. Like, yo, open your mouth. <laughs> like, why's your elbow so down? Like, because he got my motherfucking sandwich and this shit. I want my shit back. I don't want to go through all that. I don't want to go through all that. Once I keep my cookie to myself. So, we're going to start this topic off. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Right. <clears throat> Just think pop. Let me see. Ladies, you over your best friend house watching a movie mm -hmm. with her and her man. She pulls his dick out. Or her pussy. Or her pussy. We're gonna say, okay, we're going to say this. Well, I mean, however, okay, you over your best friend house watching a movie yeah. with her and her man or her and her girlfriend. Uh -huh. That sound better? Yeah, that sounds better. She pulls his dick out. Or she pulls her pussy out and start giving head. What would you do? You want to go first? Lisa, what would you do? I'm, sorry. <laughs> I'm asking y'all all questions. What would y'all, well, I mean, like literally, what would y'all do? But we know you don't mess with females. So if you over your best friend's house. Not yet, anyway. Not yet, anyway. Did she just say shields? You she said it? shields. <laughs> you bought it. <laughs> she said shields now. Shields. You must say pineapples. Pineapples now. No, she didn't fall. She said shields. But I thought she, she said, said shields said, all over her body. I thought she said shields. Shields. But shields is just no shields is for you when you went to 50 50 shields all over your body. She just said pineapples. Pineapples just drop the situation. Pineapples, that shit can still happen to you. No, just say pineapples. That shit, no, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> no bitch ain't sucking on this coochie. No, no less. You ain't turning me out. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't have did it to her because I kind of work with her. What's the matter with you? We be at work and she be looking at me like this. You a 
fuck your Yeah, so pineapples. Yeah, um, not people I work with. I don't fuck people I work with. Whichever. Uh, don't say shields, because I thought you thought it. Okay, no, I'm going to fall. I can't say shields. I thought she thought thought she can say it. I said shields. I mean, I would say shields. Yeah, they always want to say that, but I mean, you know, if the nigga didn't fuck, they say shields. So then pineapples. All right, that's so much better. Because pineapples was. Like it and you're not trying to think about it. Right. Um, so, so you can kind of you, you like it. Say apples. Say some new shit. Apples. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to. I don't know what to say. Now. Just say nah, baby, nah, nah, I, nah I, I, baby, nah. I just say no. Nah. Or no. No, because then that could mean or or yeah. No. Yeah, that could mean or no yeah. It could say lies. Yeah. Lies, bitch, lies. Okay, well, lies is appropriate. Lies. Okay, so lies. <laughs> yeah, lies. Lies. Okay, we got it together. Yeah, huh? okay. <laughs> I would hate to repeat so that like, over. So right, right, like <laughs> okay, so you said I was over at my homegirl's house mm-hmm. with her and her boyfriend. Mm-hmm. She pulls out his penis. Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. And she just starts sucking his dick. What would you do? <sighs> like she's sucking his dick right there in front of you. Oh, man. I don't really have friends. So let me just see if it was somebody I really was cool with or whatever. Um, Wait a minute. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't do that. Um, so, so, <laughs> Go ahead. Um, <laughs> that was this is an irrelevant question for her. <laughs> I don't know. If I had some honey dang out, then I'm I might do it. I might I might I might do you it. Might do what? I might. You might join in. Yeah, I might join in. Not <laughs> yeah, like I might I might touch it. I might arch it a little bit, like you know. <laughs> you might, might you might you like so. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. I thought you would probably like she get up and leave. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, y'all go ahead and have your time. Like for real. I mean, she always shocking the shit out of me for real because she looks so innocent. Like, you know, like I mean, that's you know, how you gotta be. She you just like you, you would stroke the dick. You would stroke it or you know suck the dick. It depends on how it look. Yeah. So you would either stroke or suck the dick. So you surprised dick, me all the time. If this dick looked like less it's a still dick, I know you sing like still I have not. What about Mandingo? No, I, okay, I can well, imagine me, what a man dingo okay, is. Let though. me just, you see that? <laughs> <laughs> you probably need a dashiki. Shout out to, uh, what's the child name? Uh, you stroking it like this, you're stroking like this. And you got a, little you got a curve in it? I'm just saying. Yeah, it's got a little neck, it's got a little, you know, oh, curve. It very, <laughs> it's got a curve in it's it. A like, fat one. hook? <laughs> a little hook that got a little curve in it. Like, you know what I'm saying? Shift. <laughs> I'm interested. Maybe I might. I don't know. Maybe. She know yeah. that she. You gotta seen. go like on the dick. Now like. Lisa know that she's saying her homegirl sucking this man dick, and his dick is like man. I mean, I believe that. She, I really think that she's actually giving an honest fucking answer that she I would probably, probably, probably really join the fuck in because you gotta realize the quiet ones are really more, more than likely are the kinkiest ones. Like they're the ones that really jump out that motherfucker for real. Right. They got the like, drinking. One life to live, and they just like but you know see, out that it, bitch. The keyword I said is that I don't really have friends like that. Right. So if I'm old, around them, I'm not her friend. Because otherwise it's against the code. But if we're not friends and I'm some bitches don't there, care. Well, I mean, like, it, 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 well, what we said is your best friend. So, like, like literally, friend, I mean, like, I would think you know, even if my best friend starts to pull out dicks or pussies in front of me, mm-hmm. you know, what I'm saying one is because you're comfortable to do it. Two is because you know, what I'm saying you had the feeling that you just wanted to do that shit and show me off. You mm-hmm. feel me? To see what I was going to do in the first motherfucking place. Right. You feel me? And three, bitch, you wanted to have this mix of pie ready any motherfucking way. You wanted to mix this thing up. You wanted to have the two girls with your motherfucking man or the two girls with your motherfucking woman and get that thing popping. That's the way that you did it without accident. Oh, they even, they even, they even try to set it up. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what I said. They set it up, you know, yeah, without accident, right. nigga. They just, boom, what's up? Throw you in mm-hmm. into the wood. You like this. What? Like, wait a minute. Can you turn the TV up? Like, you know. And they just you just sitting there, so like so I understand. Just turn into Netflix and chill. I, that one, nobody gave me the memo. Just turn it to yeah. Pornhub and chill. Right. I'm gonna yeah. turn it to that's Pornhub bitches, and that's chill. That's bitches they do. They give you some fucking alcohol and get you all drunk and tipsy. Yeah, keep on drinking. Yeah, keep drinking, bitch. You want another cup? No. Yeah, we gonna get hot ass. It'll be like you know, you know when it's really like you know when Lies. it's really like been playing between them two. <laughs> Because the motherfucker, when the bitch nigga getting his dick sucked over that, but for real, the nigga go to grab for like your hand and shit. You like that? Wait a, Wait a minute. Why are you caressing my hand? Huh? Head down there. Like, what's up? What's up? So, he look like, come on. Let me ask Diamond the same question. What about you, Diamond? <laughs> what, what, what's the question? I didn't know the question. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Right, so, Sorry. if you was over your 
No, I ain't gonna say that. Okay, so <laughs> your girlfriend and you and her no, best what? friend. What? What? No, what? Listen, your girlfriend. No, you can say it to him like that too. Okay. He was over his best girlfriend's house. She gave yeah. be a lesbian or over her no, her best saying. homeboys. Or no, best I mean, it's house. a lot of ways this can go. I could be over one of my homeboys' house and his girl starts that, or I could be at. A, a homegirl's house. How have you want to say? I, I could have been at a party and it could just could have just happened. But he still has to be the person on the outside. He can't be the person that's right. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. You said you the person. Okay, you over your best friend's house. Okay. And his bitch starts sucking his dick okay. in front of you. Okay. Okay. What would you do? It depends. Did we plan this? No. Did you didn't plan anything? You didn't. Plan oh no. Nah. Just there. So if and this and is his girl. Yeah. This yeah. is a girl. Yeah, if, if if that's his girl, girl so I, you couple, know, whatever. Now it it just depends. So, so how do y'all know I haven't been in this situation before? We don't. That's why we're asking you now. I mean, I had been in a situation. Like I'm sure you have. That's why you. That's why you came with the question. Um. Yeah. So I. So I I've been in a in a situation that we kind of arranged the situation. So we had there were there were these two girls who we knew did not like each other, right? And so we purposely set up a situation to have the two girls at his house. Mm -hmm. One of the girls liked me. One of the girls liked him. And well, the two girls were friends at one time, but they had a major fallout. So I thought it would be funny to have the two girls come over. So the two girls came over, and we, we had this plan because he had been with the girl, obviously, and I had been with the girl that liked me. But we wanted to be with the other girls. Okay. So we tried to bring them over to the house, and then... we. Right, and then we want we were going to switch. So, but we didn't think that they would agree to it. So, how, what we had planned was they came over to the house. We had the lights off. We was in the room. Then he was supposed to get up and leave out, and then I was going to go over where he was at. Was play exactly, and he was gonna come back and get where I was at. So that's so we had the whole thing set up. So he was supposed to leave, go to the bathroom. I was supposed to get up and change the music, and that's how we had the plan. Perfect. He left out, boom, I went to the go change the music. Then when we come back at the same time, he, I was going to go where he was. He was going to go where I was. So I went where he was. Well, correction, he had went where I was, and then the girl, his girl was like, wait a minute. Well, correction, my girl was like, wait a minute when she saw him. Like, what are y'all trying to do? So she got mad and left. So now I'm just in the room chilling. And so he goes back to his girl. So they start fucking, Right. So I'm just chilling, like, dang, I got nothing to do. And so, <laughs> so, I call, so I call a girl up on the phone. So I'm talking to another girl on the phone. I'm laying on the bed. They on the floor. So next thing I know, the bitch come back. No, she's gone. She's gone. That bitch got on that bed. So I was like, yeah, yes, yeah. right. So that was the show. His, his session, see, and this is why I say the, the threesome thing missed for me all the time. Because... For whatever for whatever reason, he reached his point quick and he was done. So Dang. then she was still like, "Hey, Dang, you know what I mean." <laughs> so next thing I know, he leaves out for, for real, for real, and then she's right there. So I'm like, "What? All right, I'm gonna call you back." And I got the phone, and then so so I hit his girl, but he didn't hit mine. Sorry, you know what I mean. But it, it, it still worked out for you. It, it worked out for me. It technically wasn't a threesome because. He stopped. Yeah. And then I went. So, you know, yeah. just that's how my threesomes always go. It's always some kind of mm, so I I, so I pointless story actually. But <laughs> the point is is that it depends on who it was and a, a lot of things. If it's his girl, then I'm gonna say no. Right. Um and because I would just wouldn't feel you know like, comfortable if it's his girl. Now, if it's just a girl that we know. Or he's, it's just, you know what I mean? It's not somebody, certain, like, if they, she lived there or some shit like that. No, that was, it's crazy. Is that all about a respect thing? Because it's Yeah, it's all about a respect thing. <laughs> must and if I got to see her, and if I got to see her again, you know what I mean? Like, say we do cookouts, and, like, if it's somebody I'm really close with, that's that's kind of crazy. It seems, it seems like men have more conscious, conscious, consciousness. Uh -huh. And um in situations like that with not wanting to fuck the home girl the homeboy's girlfriend and bitches don't have that kind of conscious ways though we'll fuck the shit up your man and, and see him every motherfucker day and won't worry about it. Just walk past him. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> it's a general fuck. How you doing? Yeah. yeah and still I've say hi that. to the bitch. Hey, hey. I've seen that. I've seen <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So like 
is there like like you know i'm just trying to figure out like is there like a, a thing that like weighs on the mind of a male to be like oh man that's my homeboy and i fuck this bitch you know what i'm saying like because that doesn't weigh on the mind of a woman we, you know, like mean? literally, you, it's what, like what the less mean? fuck given in that area. Like fucking somebody else's a woman having to fuck one of their homegirls, men, is not something that weighs on the mind of a woman. They had to be walk away, it's like, oh my god, it's my homegirl man. Fuck no, it's my homegirl man. Oh well, fuck them, go about my business. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, that's, that's it. That's a little crazy. So, so for me, I can't speak for you know everybody, but uh, I mean, no, generally, if I know the, that. if I know the guy. I, I wouldn't, yeah, I just, I, that's just something I don't do because it's, and it's probably different for y'all because for us, it is, we're in demand. We're, y'all, it's the ratio, the ratio is kind of crazy, right? So that's what I'm saying. <laughs> what I mean by the ratio, this is how the ratio is. This is how the ratio is in it's life. Three to one. It's three to it's one. Three to one. Okay. Yeah. So I mean, you can't really say y'all in if it's demand three to because one, y'all really not so, in demand. Well, since it's three like, to one, we don't have to do it. like we can pick and choose. Y'all kind of suffering do. now. I mean, huh? y'all kind of suffering. Y'all been kind of suffering for a long time. Is that? Because I mean, at the end of the day, you have to realize something. Women are really into need of having a man because one, we can please ourselves. You can Two, what? we can always depend on another woman to please us. Okay. And having a man is just an option. Okay. To be honest with you. See, so I've never had I've never had women. this conversation with somebody before, so I, I have a, a news flash for you. Yeah. Look, look, so, listen, listen, let me say this. Let me your this. your let me, girlfriend, let me your girlfriend. I got I have a news flash for you. Okay, wait, wait. Your girlfriend, you ready? Mm -hmm. Is not gay. I wouldn't say she was. I'm saying she's not. I wouldn't say she was either. Right. And why would you say she was? You agree with me? Why would you say she was? Because she just wants a sensitive man. <laughs> That's crazy. Cause um, I wouldn't say that she wants a sensitive man because if she wanted a sensitive man, then she wouldn't be with a hard bitch. Because if you're looking <laughs> for a sensitive man, there's no reason to come to an aggressive woman to look for something sensitive. Right. I can't give you anything sensitive. All I can do is give you the average kind of male point of view from my own woman point of view. But uh, you I'm, lost me right there. Like, like this is the thing. I'm like the closest thing to a nigga that a bitch will ever have. Okay, I agree with that. Having to be a nigga, right? You know what I'm saying. But the difference, the, here's the difference. The difference is your level of compassion. So when I said the sensitive man, all I mean is that the, here's the difference. You don't know my level of compassion. Yes, I do. No, you don't. Let me tell you why I do. Yeah, no, you because don't. You, because you, you're a woman, so it's like y'all oh, was talking off camera. Y'all was talking off camera, so you can understand different things that I could not understand. Because you felt those things. Does that make sense? You've actually felt those things too. You just don't, don't know how, how you felt those things. No, You've no, never no, been no, in no, the no, same no. situation for you to no, feel no, no, those no, no. I mean, literally. I mean, now, like, literally, like, like woman stuff. With her, yeah, like I'm woman gonna stuff. Say, like, like, I'm say you talk say about your I, cycle. I, I like, you could talk about the cycle, right? Yeah, like the that. menstrual cycle. The guy, we can't, we can't, we can only understand it for a certain degree. Like it's something that's in the history book, yeah, this is like, like slavery. Should... Like we can read it, but, see, but we didn't like really those... understand see, it because we didn't do it. You can say that about something. you actually had a period, about, so but, you can understand. And I, but it's a lot of things you guys have that I can't. I'd be like, oh, well, your dick's get, your dick gets hard. I can't say I have no experience about that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But yeah. if I had to go ahead and have a give, like you know, a general relation of how it might happen, then I can go ahead and give it from my own point of view how my shit gets to almost to maybe to a browser point. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You can, I might can't give the whole full effect, but I can give you a little bit of about it. You can give me a little bit about being on the pretty too. That's because you've been around a woman. You know exactly when she's about to come on, how she's going to feel. So you go ahead, throw her some motherfucking pills, rub on her belly, get her some motherfucking tampons. You're there companionship for that, for that point in time which she's yeah. going through. Yeah. I can be there for companionship with my bitches going through too, but because I go through it doesn't mean that I understand this shit. No, no, but no. I, th I think it I, th I think that's what gives you you the edge over a guy. Well, is, a is just that little, know. the little, that little part like you know you, because you experienced it. I think that's the. No. I think that level is what makes women who I think are not gay go to the other side because it's just that extra level of understanding that we just can't. It's like that next level. But I would say my I would say my bitch was gay because you know what I'm saying at the end of the day without having any male contact you feel me saying and, and not missing out on anything would make you a strong enough gay woman you feel me now coming from my point of view you feel She's what I'm gay. saying yeah I'm saying like I'm not gonna say that I wouldn't be gay either you feel me but I'm not gonna say that I would be gay a lot of people wouldn't look at me about being gay because I have to have, I had a child I've been in male relationships you feel me but I'm just using my thing for the coin 
<laughs> as I've always done. So that's the difference for the coin. All right. And that's always, been a, that's always been a difference. But my thing is like this, even still in that point of view that you just tried to bring up, if a man listens, they can get a whole fucking lot of miles with a woman. It's because they don't listen and don't pay attention. Just because I've been through these things, Sorry. I can go through a whole bunch of shit that a woman goes through and still not understand it. That's how the same thing most these bitches out here don't even wash their pussies for referral because they don't they haven't been shown how to wash their pussies. All they've been shown is how to get into the water. You have to show somebody who have to actually, you know what I'm saying, go through something and show them how to go ahead and get over that shit before you can actually say that you've been through something. You can go through the shit, but I ain't been through shit. You understand what I'm saying? So if you listen, you can have a lot of miles on me just by listening. That's what you have to do is listen. A lot of niggas don't listen. They just sit up there talking like, yeah, babe. All right, yeah, all right. Then, then, then. And oh my God, that is gone. so true. You feel me? I'm not going to say, so the only reason I'm going to say that that happens because I do the same shit. My bitch is like, what I said earlier? What? <laughs> what? No, like, I, I, but I had a lot of women all right, that, cool. yeah, that yeah, yeah, was like but more. Y'all run a whole bunch of weight. Y'all run a man. whole lot. Y'all run actually a bunch of miles on bitches if you listen. Mm -hmm. You can't say that we've been through some shit. A lot of people have been through some things and still ain't learned shit from it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's all in the same circle of a, a whole bunch of shit. But I'm just saying, that's how you, you listen, motherfuckers. You listen. You, you get your bitches you back. Time. Fight to get your bitches back. Get your bitches back. Listen to get your bitches back. You feel what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? That's just it. That's, that's why a lot of men are losing out on their women because they're not listening to the bitches. They're not. <laughs> and then there's niggas like me that come along, like, hey, baby, don't worry about that nigga. You don't know how, hey, I know how I feel. Yeah, I know how I feel. <laughs> probably don't know how shit feel, but because I'm a woman, she like, she know. She really does know. I probably don't know shit. But I got your bitch. But it's get true, your bitch though. Back. But it's, it's fucking true. It's true. It's true. It's true. Okay, you guys, we're going to take a break real quick, and we'll be back. Let's break on this shit. Fight to get your bitches back for the coin.